We're all very proud that WGV uh, has been endorsed as a water-wise development. It's about how we really weave a water-sensitive design approach into places that are livable for us and others. The on-ground measurement program being implemented ex includes extensive monitoring across the community bore distribution network, potable water use, plum rainwater and stormwater infiltration. These systems will help identify a cross-precinct water savings and promote non-drinking water use, reducing the burden on our high quality drinking water supplies. I just love that we've got permanently designed garden settings that will be water-wise forever and the concept of centralised third pipe schemes so we can substitute potable water with the community bore water is just a great, great way forward. The decentralised approach at WGV is that um, we have rainwater at the household scale for use inside for uh, toilets uh, and washing machines. And then we have the community bore concept where that bore not only provides water for the public open space but also services each lot to meet its outside water use. The various water saving initiatives that WGV has been able to incorporate will mean that the average household will be able to save 70% of typical water use as compared to the average metropolitan home. Of the work that Josh is doing and the work that Landcorp's doing is that this is showing that normal people can make modest changes in the way they build and develop to have an exceptional result. As the agency responsible for the sustainable management of the state's water resources, we are very, very interested in how to identify effective water saving approaches and promote the uptake through collaboration. WGV presents an amazing opportunity to showcase not only uh, water innovations in terms of design and technology, but also provides an opportunity for us to capture data and share data and have this as a, uh, I guess, a shared learning exercise like no other project that is happening certainly here in Western Australia and potentially nationally. So congratulations to the WGV estate by Landcorp in White Gum Valley, which is being endorsed today as the 14th Waterwise Development in Western Australia. Improving the productivity of water use is the most cost effective way to achieve resilience to a drying climate in our towns and suburbs.